Welcome to Doug Does Stuff. I'm Doug, and today we're doing Creality Sprite Extruder. Not the Pro, just the Sprite Extruder. And I'm not using my microphone, so I'm trying to do this quick. Um, I've been having problems, as you know. I came across some posts that this might be the problem, and to look at it. Well, in trying to tighten it, or look at it before I even did, I could see that the adjustment screw, I don't know if you can see that, which is why I'm turning it, is all cockeyed. So uh, what we're going to do is take this off and see what's going on on the inside. All right, here we go. I actually do have to leave here in about two minutes, uh, but I want to get this off and see what's going on. And then I'll come back after the visit to the vet and uh, go from there. So here we go. Really simple, just a couple screws. You got to take off this front one that holds that down. Take these two off and hope nothing comes flying out at us. One, two, let's put these off to the side. All right, here we go. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, see, I don't know if you can see that. Let me zoom you in here. Ba, ba, ba. This is actually my second Sprite extruder with the same problem. The, gosh darn it, Creality. This is all messed up in here now. This is going to go flying. Shoot. All right, we're going to have to try and get this off, get that off, get the spring off. I don't know if you can see what I'm doing here. Yeah, that's all messed up. That's all messed up in there. Is that going to come off? Come on. Oh. Yeah, this is not going to be easy, is it? Let's see if we can get this out of here and not shoot it across. There we go. There's that at least. Is this going to come out? Nope. No, of course not because that's all. There we go. That will come out. Let me zoom you out just a little bit. Sorry, sorry, sorry. That came out. Let's get the spring out of there. Jeez, I wonder if this was part of my problem with all my extrusions. Oh, look at that. Super duper. I got to tell you, I'm really disappointed in Creality and their quality uh, control here because this, there we go, does not look great. All right, what I did find, I don't know, is that broken in there? Oh, man, even with my glasses on, I can't see that well. Uh, I don't think so. Anyway. Um, yeah, so we got to put the spring back in. Let me move it down here. We got to put this whole assembly right here. Over here, don't disappear. Gosh darn, excuse my hairy hands. Uh, we got to put this whole assembly back together, put that in here, and then we're going to tune it. And I'm going to show you what I did on my other one, which seemed to have worked pretty well because originally this little nut, at least in my other one that I took apart sat in the spring like in the middle of it doesn't make sense anyway stick around all right so it's uh not after the vet it's 24 hours later um we have the football game on but let's get this together as you can see i took the screw I can't pick this thing up there we go took the screw uh, i put on the nut and what you got to do is once you do that, you put it in there. All right. Next step, let's get this spring into place. All right. And then the next thing is to get on this little piece. Let's see if we can do this. Get on there. There we go. All right. So now we're on. So now that we're on, this is it would be this way in your extruder, um, or this way. No, no, this way. At least in mine. Um, now we got to turn this to tighten the spring up so that this is tighter and we can pull filament through. So I'm going to do it here. Now, to increase tension, 
we're going to turn counterclockwise and it should push that nut oh boy I'm gonna have to hold it because I don't want it to go flying out it's part of the problem right Let's see. So I think I was wrong we're gonna have to go counterclockwise no we go clockwise so going clockwise as you can see is pushing that nut pushing that nut down Increasing pressure on the spring. Alright. And now it feels like there's a little bit of tension there. So we can keep going more and more. And as we do this, I think this is where the problem comes in. If we do too much, it's gonna come off the end of that the end of that uh, bolt in there. So that's pretty good. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to put this back together. Right, am I? Yeah, there we go. That goes in there. Perfect. Now you can see our screw is not off-center like it was. And we're going to put the nuts back together. Nuts, bolts, whatever they're called. <sighs> up a little bit at a time oh, pause and continue right, get this tightened down pretty tight and while you're in there clean out any um, dried or filament scraps or anything like that you might find in there right, put these back together Not the right size. Everything's a different size, right? Come on. There it goes. Alright, so now, once we have this tightened down, and that's just the guide for the filament going in. Nothing crazy. Take some filament. Let me zoom you out here far as you can go. We're going to put our filament in and it's going to come through the bottom, right? So now we're in there. So what this does is, as you can see, that, that actually feels great. <laughs> um, I can pull nothing. If I put a little more tension, then it slips out. Um, you don't want so much tension that you're deforming your PLA, that's what I'm using. And you don't want too little that it just slips in and out and not so much that you can't even move it. This, I can't push it through unless I release on the spring. Right, there we go. And I'm gonna push more down here. And I can't pull it unless I give it a really good tug. Let me do it one more time for you. Come out the bottom this time. Yeah, that doesn't pull very easily. So cool. Um, we have our Sprite extruder put back together. We have the tension hopefully set correctly. Hopefully this is going to eliminate some of our problems. I'm going to go ahead and get it back on. And uh, that's it for this video. Like, subscribe, and see you in the next one. When we talk about my Ender... 3 and V2 Neo from Hell.